so last week i made a video showing you my old youtube studio tool since now that i have this new youtube studio and today in this video i'm going to show you how i color grade uh, my videos when i used to be in those old studio so basically this is like uh, the continuation of that video so if you want to watch the studio tour before this make sure to hit the i button or click the link in description so in this video like i said i'm going to show you how i color grade my youtube videos for beginners in davinci resolve 16 video editing software now if you use premiere pro final cut pro or like other software like that you still may be able to do this because this is like a very beginner friendly tutorial so without any further ado let's just begin but before that my name is Brazil Bosnet and we make videos about videography and photography. So if these are some of the stuff that you're interested in, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. And now let's begin. So in my laptop you can see this is a small clip from that uh, video just to show you how I color grade. Now right here I have already color graded my videos but I'll show you how. So select your clip and go to color tab. Now for those who don't know, DaVinci Resolve 16 has its like own color tab uh, for uh, like uh, for After Effects it has Fusion so for different needs it has different tabs so after you click in color tab this is how it looks so you can see there are like these three different boxes this is what you call note now you don't need to get confused with it just do as I say okay if you've just started your color tab will look something like this with only one node so click on this first node right click add node add serial sorry add serial now click on your second node right click add add node add serial same thing now we have three nodes so click on the second node now we're not going to touch our first node we're going to start from second node or second rectangle to make you easy so click on the second rectangle or as we say node once you do that go to this qualify tab now you can see that uh go to the selection range and here you'll see like this picker tool okay right here click on it and now select pick a color you can see my entire background most of it is blue color so we're going to select blue color as i click blue color or i pick blue color you can see in the node like some gray gray particle can be seen that is basically anything except our selection so we want uh, all of the blue color to be selected except us and other thing so at this qualifier down you can see hue saturation increase this or decrease this just play with them to get the like the desire you want okay as you can see now you can only see most of the like blue background at there some part of me over here is also being selected that is because of not having uh, like light that is just focus on me because we're shooting in sunlight back then so once you have selected this click to this maximum tab right here okay and click doing this your screen gets big now you can see at the side here this color wheels there are four wheels don't be confused or don't be afraid all you need to do is you can see this point in the middle click it and just move it around and as you move it you can see the color will also change so i will make it the kind of blue i want because you can see in default like the blue in the background is too much so i'll just decrease it and like i said you need to do nothing just select a color in this case it was blue and then just click on any of these points leaf gamma and just move around just play and see what you like okay and if you do anything wrong click on this arrow right here it will default everything so now we're going to do this so now minimize this by clicking here and click on node 3 go to this qualifying tab in selection rates click picker select your skin or your face 
now from the tab make sure to select everything make sure that in the node only your face can be seen so again maximize and again the same thing in this wheels click on any wheels and just change like just play and see what you like so i think like this is good enough so minimize and like i showed you nothing hard i just selected a note i went to qualifier type i went to selection range click the speaker select a color and then increase like just selected myself in the node you can see and then went on to this color tab color wheel and then just click on any button and just play around with them and you can see this is good enough now so it before and after as well now you can see it is not like day and night difference because uh, i have a smartphone so that's why it cannot shoot on flat profiles so most of the time you won't even need to do color grid but sometimes when you have to this is like a very very easy method and from now on i have planned that every wednesday i'll be making an editing tutorial and every saturday or sunday i'll be making some different videos so if you don't want to miss out on that make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification icon also smash the like button as it helps with the youtube in all engagement like i said we'll see you next wednesday till then thank you and bye